I'm Father Frank Pavone, National Director of Priests for Life. Welcome to Mandate Minutes. We're reflecting on our challenge against the HHS mandate in the U.S. Supreme Court. Well, Priests for Life has been making this argument all along, that anyone who has religious ex uh, objections to the mandate should have a religious exemption from the mandate. And many of these religious exemptions have been granted. Your local parish church, for example, is exempt from the mandate. And what we are saying is all of us religious nonprofit groups like Priests for Life who have the same objections to the mandate based on our religious convictions should also share the exemption. What that means is that we don't have to do anything in regard to the mandate. We don't even have to send a letter registering our objection. We don't have to make any alternate provisions for our employees to receive coverage for abortion-inducing drugs and other objectionable practices. We don't have to uh, make any other arrangements whatsoever. We just do nothing, and we are exempt from the mandate. That's the way it should be, and that's what we are arguing in court. Stand with us at IStandWithPFL.com. I'm Father Frank Pavone of Priests for Life.